see what the hell going on. You know what I'm talking nah, about? Man, I'm uh, you put your phone on mute. Don't say nothing until you're queued in, and you'll know what's going on. We'll go from there. All right. All right. Thank you, man. All right. All right, John. Hold on. Yeah. Uh, I think he was going to say something, Charlie. Just bitch your tongue. But he keeps saying we keep having these petty arguments. But what's petty to him might be everything and some. Right. right. Hello? Good morning, Master Speaker Monique, please. This is her. Hey, Monique, how you doing? I'm doing well. Who's calling? Uh, this is Monique, this is nothing too serious. It's just a friendly phone call from your favorite cousin, Young Jock. I have Sue okay. Solo and Shawty Shawty on the phone. Hey. We're calling as the Streets Morning Takeover. That's the name of our morning show. We got a segment on the show called Second Date All Day. Awesome. Yes. Awesome. You're probably trying to figure out why we're calling you. I am. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. What's going on with you and John? Me and me and John? Yeah. Yep. John already knows what's up. I've been talking to John for weeks. He has some dusty, untidy braids, and I'm sick of it. You said what? No, hold on. Tell what? Me. You called them dusty. They're dusty, they untidy, they don't look clean, and I'm tired of it. What's oh. untidy? His braids, they, they look terrible. It was a quarantine hairstyle. In the beginning, he was growing his hair out over quarantine. I was with it, and now quarantine's over. He's wearing these things out. He's taking me out with these braids, and I, I just can't handle it anymore. And I told him about it. I told him over and over again, and he's hard headed. And I'm not gonna keep putting up with it. Wow, you left the man because his braids be dusty. It's dirty. I felt him dangerous, <laughs> and it's just unclean, unprofessional. I'm not, oh. I'm not putting up with it. That's not something I want to take home to my mama, so. Well, let me ask you a question, because you sound like a professional woman. Uh, what do you do for a living? I'm a teacher. You're a teacher, okay. I'm a teacher and at, a, at a middle school. Okay, so you, you didn't have a problem with the braids in the beginning, but now they're a problem. Right, it's just unprofessional, and he's a grown man, and he needs to grow up. Okay, well, here's a chance to uh, let it be known that he actually heard you in front of the whole world, because uh, he's actually on the phone. John. Yo, hey, Monique, man, I don't, I don't <laughs> man, you funny as hell, man, because I really don't say nothing about that little bit ass ponytail that you got up under that wig, you know. Wait, yeah. 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 <laughs> you know, now, 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 I'm going to be real with you now. You know, I've been coming into my consciousness, so I'm going to keep my braids because Samson had his hair. When Samson cut his hair, that's when he lost all his power. So I'm keeping all my praise okay. because I'm a king. Oh, so you're going to you bring know? the Bible into this now? I mean, I mean I'm mean, i not a Christian, baby. You know, I'm not a Christian. I'm into African spirituality. So mm -hmm. Samson was a black man, and I'm a black man. So I want to grow my hair just like the black man of back in the day, you know. And when you cut it, you lose your power. But if you don't want to be with me no more, it's okay. You know, I understand. John, if you're going to have your hair out, you should at least keep it up. But... There's a time and a place for that. You're a grown man. Grow up. Grow up. Baby girl, you're missing the message. You're yeah. missing the message because he is woke. He is into Hebrewism. And if he fix his hair, if he cut his hair, then they're not going to let him read when they be like, and he came for Read. There's no need for him to say all that. He's not into his roots. He's not into his culture. This is just something he thought of and now he wants to do because it's a trend, I guess. Man, Monique, man, do it. You know, the whole issue is I'm not going to cut my hair. You know, you know, whenever you start going natural and you believe to be the queen that you is, then you can come talk to me. But you can't talk to me and you wearing, you know, somebody else's hair on top of your head. You can't talk to me. You can't talk about nothing about me. You know, so. But you called trying to get her back. Yeah, but he, I'm pretty sure he don't want to be ridiculed because he actually saying something sure. that, that kind of sound like something. Keep going, bro. I'm with yeah, you. man, you know, yeah, I, 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 I called trying to get her back, but after hearing what she was saying about me, you know, it's like, you know, you really don't like me as a person. You just like me with my hair cut, you know. You know, so if I was to get um fat, would you like me then? No. So it's like you really don't like me. You just like the person that I was at that time. But my mind has changed. I elevated, you know, within well, nine months. That. You, you know, if you don't like that, then you just got to keep it pushing. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you read her like you be reading the Bible downtown. You don't read the Bible, Shouty. He just said he don't read it. Whatever he read, he read her just no. Uh, it just sound like I don't know what 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 it's gonna be, baby girl. Um, cause she sounds like she's on her square, he's on his too. Uh, is it any way that you could possibly see y'all getting back together? Whether he cut his hair or not, like it's all on you right now. Keep it clean. Take the jewels out. Keep it. 
shape the edges shaped up, and maybe we can work something out. Oh, okay, well, he's not doing it. It's not like he's nah, not doing girl, it. I'm not taking the, uh, the bees off my hair, baby girl, so, you know, um, you know, we can work something out then, you know, but I'm not taking my bees off my hair. Well, damn, it just got empty like that. Okay, I, I guess the love went real. Ah, uh, we have a 1-800 engine with the law firm. Y'all would not be getting this $100. Can we get somebody to get this damn money, man? All this love, where is the love? Y'all call us up. Let's talk about this second date update. one 866 young jock one Call us up right now. Keep it where you got it. Young Jock in the streets morning take over. Morning show, check in with me. Yo. She just wanted to take over and talk about the second and update. <laughs> Thank you for your class, what? Not necessarily. Because if you're looking dust, then that's not something you attracted to. If you ain't attracted to that. Streets want to take over talk about the second and update. I knew you was coming with a commercial. I felt it coming. See? Okay, I'll braid them for you. Hit me on Instagram, man. Streets want to take over. Talk about the second of the update. Thank you. Thank you for your call.